to ask the man to resign. In fact, by the time we got there, we had passed the stage of resignation because it was clearly established that he's incapacitated and unable to resign, even if he wanted to. So we started saying he must go. Uh, so they found it over power. But what is clear was that there's no instrument of handover that was transparently done. The letter sent to the House of Assembly at the state was not made public. It was not signed. And the reason we didn't have a letter was because people who were forging his signature to carry out fraud in the state at that point had been outed and probably couldn't forge another uh, letter. So, so we're not satisfied with that. We still want the man, having been incapacitated, to step aside completely. And uh, that uh, decision has to be made by the State House of Assembly. Uh, and they're not the kind of people I'm proud of, I will, I will tell you, uh, to ask to invoke what they call the doctrine of necessity, make this one um, a governor.